Now, we have talked about spiritual abuse before. Churches that would twist the Word of God and being the Holy Spirit. You had shared with me that you had suffered so much from the faith community that should be supporting you. They would say terrible things about your children or you. What's that crazy story you told me that, oh, God told me to tell you this. And you were like, <laughs> what? Okay. Uh, yeah, so in our churches, people were well-meaning, but they just were not able to understand their girls where they were coming from. So there was just a lot of rejection. But the story you're talking about happened when I was speaking at a women's retreat at a different church. And this woman came in at the end and she said, God told me a word. I have a word for you. And I'm like, oh my goodness. So I just prayed God, if there's anything true in here you want me to hear, I just want to have an open mind. So she said, you are trying to make your girls into you. It's just very obvious that you did not accept them as they are. I did your Bible study and you would talk about trying to teach them to talk. So you were trying to make them like you instead of making them capital D deaf. These are the people God created them to be capital D deaf. And so I, God just wants you to change that part of your behavior. That was very offensive. And I said, um, okay, I hear what you're saying, but I just have to say to you that if what you're saying is true, then what you're telling me is I have walked in willful disobedience to the Lord all these years. Mm -hmm. My husband and I have sought the Lord's face. We have leaned into God. We have prayed for God to direct us. And we have had to make some very difficult decisions. We have obeyed everything he has revealed to us. And so after I said that, she said, but God has told me that your girls need to be in ministry to the deaf. And I said, well, if that is the case, then I know God will tell them that that is what he has called them to do. And so I just prayed for her, but gosh, it was so upsetting for me. It took me about three hours to recover from her accusations. But um, eventually I was able to just let it go. I was able to just surrender it to the Lord.